I have an LHR 3070 and a non LHR 3070. And because of that, I've been able to test if the 100% LHR unlocker is actually fake or not. So stick around. Warning, there are people pretending to be me in the comments and on social platforms. I'll never ask you to add me on WhatsApp or Telegram, and I'll never ask you to send me money, crypto, or your personal information. All right, so please be careful, use your common sense, and don't let any of these imposters fool you. All right, now back to the video. Hey, how's it going GPU heads? Thanks for clicking on my video. Seb Heslo here. And in this video, I'm gonna show you two different tests that I did on the new 100% LHR unlocker in NB minor and also T-Rex minor. And I'm sure it's gonna be in all the different minors soon where I'm testing if the 100% unlock is actually real or if it's just fake. So the first test that I've been doing is just measuring inline power draw of LHR GPUs versus non-LHR GPUs to see if there's something dodgy going on with how it's using the power going into it. Because you know, with the old partial unlocker that gave us around 80%, we saw big power spikes and dips. So I just wanna check if there's something dodgy going on like that to kind of give us a clue. But the more important test that I've done is I've also ran two LHR 3070s and two non-LHR 3070s to count the amount of shares they're actually submitting to the pool within a 12 hour window. Yeah, I know in my previous video I said I was gonna do it for 24 hours, but I wanted to get this video out and I think the results are clear after just 12 hours. So what I did was I ran one LHR 3070 in NB minor with the 100% unlock and one non-LHR 3070 in NB minor you know, with no unlock because it's non-LHR to see if they get the same amount of shares. But then I also ran another non-LHR 3070 in T-Rex minor to see if it would get the same amount of shares as in NB minor. And I also ran a LHR 3070 in T-Rex minor with the older partial, you know, 80% unlock to see if that gave us fewer shares, right? So that's what we're gonna have a look at as well as power draw in line with these GPUs. So let's have a look. All right, so we're up and mining on the full hash rate 3070 in NB minor. And you can see we're getting about 62 mega hash. And here you can see I'm measuring the power in line directly off the GPU. <laughs> Fans not even spinning yet. Um, but as you can see, the power consumption is just staying steady, just above 120 watts or so. And that's what we expect for a 3070 non-LHR, right? Like it should just stay pretty steady around 125 or so. All right, and here we have my LHR 3070 running with no LHR unlocker in T-Rex minor. And as you can see here, then it's pulling around 100 watts or so, and it's kind of steady around 100 watts. All right, so now we're up and mining on the LHR card with the 80% partial unlock in the older version of T-Rex minor. You can see here we're getting just below 50 mega hash at a 78.9% unlock. and here you can see what I mean with the power jumping around. So it sticks around 120 and then all of a sudden it jumps down to like under 100. And sometimes it dips well above 130 as well. So that is what we want to see if it's still doing with the 100% unlock or if it's more stable now. All right, so now finally we're up and mining on the LHR card with the 100% unlock. And you can see here we're getting 62.2 mega hash and yeah power consumption is looking flawless, super steady, just above 120 watts, just like what we saw on the full hash rate 3070. So yeah, definitely doesn't seem to be anything dodgy going on there. All right, so so far it's looking really good with the power consumption. I was worried it was gonna be still doing some dodgy up and down thing with the power, or that it was gonna pull, you know, lower amount of power like when, you know, LHR isn't unlocked like we saw on the LHR card in the earlier version of T-Rex. But no, it pulls just above 120 watts steadily, just like the non-LHR card does. So everything seems to be perfect there. However, in mining, we're not getting paid for our hash rate. We're getting paid for the amount of shares that we submit to the pool. So that's why I wanted to check if the LHR card with the 100% unlock submits just as many shares as the non-LHR card would. So let's hop on over and have a look at that. All right, so let's have a look at this test where I ran four different 3070s for 12 hours to measure how many shares they submitted to the pool. And I mean, you can see the results right here on the screen. Uh, my 3070 LHR with the 100% unlock in NB minor submitted 277 shares, which the two 3070 non LHRs, both in NB minor and T-Rex minor submitted just a little bit more at 290, both of them. And then you can see the LHR one in T-Rex minor with the 80 or so percent unlock submitted 
way less at 218 shares in 12 hours. So basically, I would say, yeah, this is totally real. The LHR unlock is totally legit. Uh, you can see here, if you're really being nitpicky, you can see, okay, if 290 shares in 12 hours is 100% unlock, that means we're technically only at like 94% unlock, but really that could just be down to Silicon Lottery, honestly, that this, you know, LHR one is a little bit worse than the two ones I had that are full hash rate. So basically what this means is that LHR pretty much literally does not matter anymore. It has been fully unlocked. So I'm gonna be a little bit cheeky here and I'm gonna leave a few links in the description of this video to some of my favorite LHR GPUs for mining because, you know, it still might be the case that LHR GPUs are cheaper to buy than non-LHR GPUs. So if you wanna, you know, jump on this before LHR cards might go up in price, now's the perfect time. Now for full transparency, of course, those are affiliate links, which means that if you do make a purchase through those links, the channel does get a small commission at no extra cost to you. So thank you for that. Now, if you found this video helpful, then please give it one of these. And if you really liked it, you can now join the channel to help support what I do here. It really does make a big difference and it means a lot to me. So thank you. But what you got to do now is you got to click on one of those videos on the screen because this video is over. You can also click the picture on my face to subscribe to the channel. I'd really appreciate that. But yeah, go click on that next video and I'll see you there. Goodbye. Goodbye, bye, bye.